Risk Assessment for Hydro Testing of GR Rechilled Water Piping, 3.75 bar. In this video I am splitting the A3 paper for the convenience of the viewers. Pressure testing. Hazard. Non. Compliance to permit to work. Lack of communication. Incompetent personnel. Exceed maximum allowable pressure. Hydrostatic, 3.75 bar. Injury to worker. Ignoring the safety distance. Improper manual handling. Pinch points. Damage to equipment. Unsafe depressurization. Rupture of pipeline. Detachment of laminated joint. Hose or coupling failure, whipping hazard. Insufficient illumination. Poor housekeeping. Improper access. Egress, slips, trips. Safety precautions. Prior to work commence, valid work permits shall be obtained and all works conducted in LNG I shall comply with underscore permit underscore to underscore work underscore procedure. Approved method statement, approved test package, if applicable, and approved risk assessment shall be in place prior to work commence. Before starting activity, TBT. TSTI shall be conducted to identify and understand hazards and control measures. Prior to work commence, all involved personnel shall undergo required training courses in accordance with underscore H.S.E. Training plan and training matrix. Only trained, authorized personnel with yellow sticker on their helmets are allowed to do erection, modification, removal of gratings. Shall comply with all keepic. PMC approved mandatory. Required PPEs. Careful planning with all involved parties shall be done before starting the job to ensure executions will be carried out in safe manner. All piping, valves and fittings must be of approved specification. All fill piping, hose and temporary closures should have higher strength than the test pressure. Never use susceptible to brittle or stress corrosion cracking materials. All materials and equipments using shall have third-party certificate, TPC, and to be inspected before used such as hydro test pump, manifold, pressure gauge, pressure relief valve and hose. Support of piping and equipment exposed to the hydro test should have strength. Pressure relief device is required to avoid overpressure. Make sure no air trapped in the tested pipe or equipment for hydrostatic testing. Only authorized personnel are allowed to be at the test area. Hydrostatic test area has to be restricted with safety line and protected barrier. Use warning signs to warn people about the hydrostatic test in progress. Use calibrated pressure gauge for the test and shall have valid calibration certificate. It is must be able to cover 1.5 times pressure test. Communicate the test planning prior to execution. Stop the work if unsafe or potential hazardous condition found during the test. Never standing in the front of pressure gauge during the test. Enough lighting is available for the hydrostatic test. While the test is in progress, all station personnel must be kept out of the testing area. After hydrostatic test finished relief pressure first prior to draining water and releasing of water inside the test line shall be slowly and carefully. Hoses shall be safely secured. Anchored by the use of whiplash arrester to prevent whip in the event of failure. Only trained and authorized personnel can take the responsibility of the test. Defective tools. Equipments to be removed from testing area. Keep at least 50 meters away those people that are not involved on testing. Pressure test shall be carried as per SWP on pressure testing. Shall maintain proper housekeeping at all times and remove all unnecessary materials. Ensure that cables, hoses are hung, rooted or laid wherein it will not cause obstruction or tripping.
Please give comment and suggestions. Thank you. Subscribe our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for more updates. Thank for visit our channel. See you next class. Thank you.